All right, today we're gonna bring an indoor projector. Um, it's a little light, I like it. It's a box shape, all right? Um, it has a cover in the front. We're gonna show you the rest of the stuff. You get the instructions, the remote control. You get the HDMI connection. You get your power connection, two prong connection. And this is an AV connection. So if you have an old analog connection, which are red and, and white, a stereo, and then video. And then one input only, all right? It's a digital input. Now let's take a look at it, what kind of connections you can do. You got two USBs, you got your audio 3.5 jack, and then you got an AV 3.5 jack, and then two HDMIs if you need, in case you need to actually connect two different devices. On the bottom of it, you're gonna have your, your screw, so you can actually elevate this and then focus it into. So focus is gonna be in the front here, and also to move it to the front too. This is actually to open up wide. In case you lose the control, you got controls here with the OK, backwards, manual, power off, and on. Uh, one other thing I forgot to mention, in the back of it, you got the IR connection for your control. Make sure this is visible to the remote. That's where you're gonna actually remote from. And then you get a super VGA connection, old fashioned, but still works. Now you also have an IR connection in the front. Um, make sure you remove the lens caps, all right, prior to using. This is a 1080, it's not 4K, it's 1080, but this is perfect for gaming, perfect for indoor, outdoor use, but it's not waterproof, just keep it indoors. Let's take a look at a couple of features on the projector. Pretty quiet. You can hear that. You're feeling uh, 120 inches right now. You could go even higher than that. Um, all you got to do is pull it back. But this is what you got first. You have USB, AV, VGA, HDMI 1, 2, and then you could play the movies, photos, music, and screen mirror. Screen mirror is where you're going to use your phone. We're going to use our phone to mirror to it and we're going to set it up. All right, let's go ahead and mirror our, our actual iPad into it. So let me log into my iPad. I'm going to go into mirror. So I'm going to use the control and I'm going to mirror it. So it's giving you instructions how to do it. And if you guys can see the Wi-Fi signal is going right now, it's looking for it. We're going to put it on the same network. Once we set up on our same wireless, now we can go into our iPad and look for it. So follow the instructions and go to your iPad. Here we have our iPad. We're gonna bring on, on the system, we're gonna mirror it. On the mirror, now we're gonna be able to see the display here and you click on it and look at this. It's gonna come up right now. And there it is, there's the iPad. We're able to see all the features that we have here show you how good quality it is. It's actually excellent quality that's coming out. And you can see the bottom to the top. Right now I haven't filled the whole screen, but I'm gonna do that. And I'm gonna try to see if I can get you guys a little closer too. I'm gonna put the volume up a little bit higher on this one so you can see here. 4K video that we're looking at. Pretty simple, I like it. All right, let's take a look at some of the audio on the actual projector. So I'm going to do that right now. Uh, welding's a little difficult if you're not familiar with it, but with this machine, it makes it. Incredible audio. You don't need speakers. The audios are it's very, very loud. So this is going to last you a long time. Uh, for gaming, you can put games in here. All right, I want to see, show you guys that you can play PlayStation 5 in here. And of course, we're going to go ahead and uh, load up. I'm going to focus in a little bit. Quality is really good. Audio is even better. And I'm taking the whole screen here. So you can play your PlayStation 5 games. And a giant TV, giant monitor. If you're gonna enjoy yourself playing <laughs> a PlayStation with a giant projector, this is a way to do it. So very simple, easy to use. I hope you guys enjoy the video.